is up, everybody, and welcome to day number four of year end 2024. Woohoo! This is the final day of our big multi day announcement event. Now, before I continue anywhere, any further, this year has we did a completely new format than any other year. I'm not sure if this will stick for next year, but being that it, it, it's a little bit weird filming all these the four videos, but it does make things a lot easier. I'm not gonna lie, but uh, we're. But I'm not gonna. Uh, I'm also not gonna lie. Uh, the two-hour videos that we've done in the past, they've been good. They, we've put on quite the show with them and everything. They're probably never going to be two hours again. <laughs> but, uh, yeah. Welcome to day four. What is on the agenda for day four? Well, if you've been watching the last three days, well, today is projects and development. First look at worlds of series coming this year. And other things. You heard me correctly. You will be seeing the getting of a first look into our create world for season four. Um, that will be starting in early early next year. Along with a first look at the Naircraft season four world, and another project that is re-entering development for about, I wanted to say the third time, we're, we're gonna go at it again. Hopefully we are, do, do us, uh, are successful this time around. Honestly, not entirely sure, but hopefully we're successful. Anywho, let us get this started. Now, before we get any further. This video does mark the end of this channel being under the NA Army name as officially starting over the next cup over the cup next couple days our social platforms and everything will start the transition from to the rebranded stuff. Uh, D Discord is already starting, and everything else will follow suit. Uh, so, this an era, an era closes for us, but a new era will begin. In uh, just a couple, ju just a couple days, but we don't want to stick on something like that. Especially today. We got all, some fun things to talk about and fun things to uh, share, share more about. So, without further ado, let's go to the first thing that we are showing off today. And uh, we hinted at it on day one. Let's have a first look at the world we will be using for our crate series starting in the new year. Have a look -see.
It's not a crazy world. I make that very clear. Just, uh, I think the craziest thing is, uh, we have literally a woodland mansion pretty much on the doorstep of where we'll be beginning. So that is gonna be, in my view, the craziest thing. Uh, uh, knowing me, I will either try to avoid it or I will walk into it and die about 20 times. <laughs> Being that, uh, but, yep, yeah, fighting's not my strong suit. That or I just base on top of it, and that's also probably not gonna happen because then I'd probably die every single time I go back to the base. <laughs> so, yeah, Create is coming in the new year as the second version of a modded, our second attempt at a modded version of the original series that we ever did. This one I am extremely excited about. I am I kind of explained that last time around. I'm so excited to jump into the world, jump into uh, the crate mod as uh, I, I've seen so many uh, people play it over the uh, recently and like, uh, yeah. That I think it'll be quite a bit of fun. Uh, I'm not, uh, as everyone knows, I'm not technical. I'm not technical whatsoever. So, uh, it's going to be a learning curve. And anyone that I know that are, that do know the mod well are probably going to laugh. <laughs> but, um, yeah, I'm, I'm excited to start it this this uh, new year, we're aiming January, February at this very moment, but uh, that could easily change, like very, very easily. But um, I am currently un un uncertain as to like how th how we're gonna do this if we're gonna have like a a, a spawn structure or something. Uh, being a, uh, it's still early development, uh, planning for Nick, for, uh, the Crate series, but, uh, I'm certain by November we will have something, a little bit more of a concrete, uh, structure on it, and, uh, we will probably say something then, but until then, we don't really have much. So, there's not much more to go off of for that. So, let us move on to the next thing. And just so that we can get the mole out of the way, let's go and have a look at what an aircraft season 4 will look like. We tried it once, we're gonna try it again. This time around, it's mostly Badlands, if you don't know what I'm talking about. In Aircraft SMP, Season 2 was mostly based in a desert. Well, in Aircraft Season 4 of the sing single player series, 
is descending into a badlands uh, and a desert, pretty much. Now, this currently in Aircraft Season 4 does not have much in line for it. There's not much plant, there's not much of pretty much anything. All we know is we want to swing back into an aircraft, uh, an aircraft season three will conclude. I will jump back into it hopefully soon and, uh, and finish it and build, build actually build my base and everything. And, uh, yeah, season, but season four, we are going to go slightly back to an aircraft's roots. There will be challenges for that we have to complete and ev after each challenge you will get a, we will get I will get a award and so on and so forth if you have never watched uh if you never saw season one it was uh so 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 long ago now if you never watched it don't go watch it don't just don't as, uh, uh, it, it's so old now. It literally has, like, nothing to do with pretty much anything we do anymore. So, so, um, yeah. In Aircraft Season 4 will essentially be, A, a little bit of a reboot for the series, for the, um, single player series. As, um, I want to conti continue it just, I think it's started turning into something a bit too crazy, so we're going to ease it a little bit and bring it back down to reality and kind of go back to its roots. And we've done many uh, in aircrafts like season one. Uh, the modded version was very similar, just barely got it going. Uh, Ott was very, very similar, just add some changes to the changes to all the challenges. And then, well, and then came season two. We were gonna do challenges for each direction, but that ended up uh, flopping on its head and we never did them. So, uh, we are going to try this again. And, uh, hopefully this time it goes better. And hopefully we don't, uh, steer off course. But, knowing my tendencies, and knowing how every series we've usually gone, no, done, uh, go like, uh, we're gonna steer off course probably immediately. But we will see. And, uh, but, uh, an aircraft is coming. Uh, we're aiming February, March for this. February is at least where we're hoping to start. So, uh, if you're, if you're hoping for a new series, well, High Worlds is starting very soon. And then our big projects are essentially coming, in, other than High Worlds, is, are they are coming in, in the new year. So, yay! This one I am by far the most excited to, like, get back into, been, other than create, as, uh, I just, I want to kind of, I have so many ideas for, na for Nader Craft that I know wouldn't really fit with any other projects that we are doing, so I want to bring them back, and so, we will... In season four or season five, which who knows when we will get that get get there if ever. <laughs> but um, yeah. Now to round to round out like unknown things. Well, the biggest unknown and a project that we have worked on so much, and I mean so much that um. It was hard to say we weren't going to get it done the last time and that we tried re reviving it once uh, behind closed doors and that didn't work. And uh, we are going to attempt this again. And so I'm going to reset quickly and I will be right back to share what is 
coming in probably 2026. I'm just gonna leave that now, as uh, this is a very long process, and it, if we end up doing what we did, we're trying to do last time around, it's gonna take a very, very, very long time to get set. I mean, it took a, we did not want to finish doing it last time, and if we, if we end up doing the same thing again, it's gonna take longer. So, so yeah. I'm gonna reset, bring it up, and you will find out. You all will find out. So, yep. If you're reading that correctly, yep, it's coming back. If you remember, uh, I can't remember how long ago it was a project of ours, but uh, quite, a, quite a while ago now, um, a, a couple years ago now, uh, we started the project called uh, started a project uh, called Raid Island in the idea of creating a brand new series based solely off of being trapped on one island, not being able to leave, and uh, there would be bunch of mobs on the island, and you would have to and we would have to essentially craft to survive. So, Raid Island is coming back. It is, it is back alive. We are working on it. We are revamping it. We are revamping our idea for it. We are hopefully not going to be try attempting to build a giant island this time around. But that's what we did last time. We literally attempted to build a giant... We took a small island and attempted to make it a big island, which... admittedly was a bad idea. But, um, well, yeah. So, essentially, Raid Island coming back, uh, well, will be coming. We're aiming 2026 for this. It will, it, admittedly, there's a chance it's going to end up getting pushed. Being that, um, I feel like this is going to take a very long time to get up and running, especially if we decide to go the custom island route, which is gonna be <coughs> annoying. But, um, yeah, I, I'm excited to finally start working on that again. Uh, we, and like, finally bring it back to life as, uh, it has been uh, alive for a little bit, just we haven't really like full on, like, taking it that far, being that we weren't sure if we wanted to, but, um, we were, we're taking it somewhere, it's coming, it's coming back, uh, and, uh, yay, I, I think we were aiming for the first version of Raid Island, the, the version that's not coming anymore, I think it was aimed for our 10th year, which, by that, that's now pretty much two years ago, but it, it's older than that. It, it was originally aimed earlier, but then we had to delay it, and then we had to delay it again, and uh, so so on and so forth. Uh, we're, we're, it's coming back, and uh, after it got pretty much put on the back shelf for a very long amount of time. <laughs> but, um, yeah. That's pretty much everything we have to announce. Sort of. There is more. Well, there's one big thing that we decided to keep silent for this one uh, and not put it in what it was probably supposed to go in, which was yesterday, as we didn't have a proper, like, count yet. Uh, now, now, now we do. Well, pretty positive on it, so, um, yeah, let's, uh, reset quickly, and, uh, you are about to find out, uh, some big news, Pro you probably did not expect this, <laughs> I don't think anyone probably did, so, 
The High World Season 2 cast is officially locked in. Uh, well, sort of locked in. Uh, there is officially one more spot that's open. But, uh, I'm almost positive as we're pretty much a week out from Season 2 beginning. Uh, that's, that's not gonna get filled. I'm pretty darn positive of that now. I could be wrong if that spot it ends up being filled. But, currently... The cast for season one, at least at the very beginning, is sitting at thir 31 members. That is a big uptick from what it was in season one. It's going to cause for a lot more chaos. It's going to cause for a lot more fun. And, uh, well, I I'm, honestly, I'm, I'm excited for, to get rolling next next week. Uh, and, uh, yeah, I probably should have put the season, my, uh, my other skin on for the, f to announce this, but, hey, you know what? Oh, well. I'm in this one. Uh, well. Deal with it. <laughs> but, uh, yeah. 31 members, one world, high worlds, season two kicks off on next weekend as uh, it brings in a very crazy world and a very um, uh, a very crazy amount of people. <laughs> so, I I'm excited. I, I think all, all, everyone that is in the group now is uh, pretty, pretty excited to get going now. And uh, th this is going to be a fun season. Uh, ahead of us in in high worlds and uh, well yeah anywho I had to make this I want to like properly announce it uh, instead of uh, like what we were originally going to do and that was just place it at the end of the la yesterday's ep yesterday uh, we I didn't see that as being in. in in all fairness, I didn't see that being fair, being that this is like one of our biggest projects, and we were pretty much just sweeping the cast under the the cast announcement under the rug, uh, and it was supposed to be made a big thing, but um, ended up uh, needing to have a little bit more time to figure out who was going to be in the cast. And now that we're pretty certain we have our list, uh, it's I think about time to make it public. And so, it's public, it's there, and, uh, feel free to pause it and have a look, but, um, it's gonna get posted onto, our, uh, onto all, all of our social platforms, uh, probably, probably tomorrow. <laughs> well, no, pro I was about to, uh, actually, probably today, but, um, de depends if I forget or... Or, uh, yeah, if I forget. Anywho, I'm going to reset again. Be that we don't need this up anymore. And, uh, yeah. So, now with that announcement out, out of the way, it's pretty much time to call it a day for year end 2024. We will see you next year with, 25, with year end 25. We are going to do the, keep doing these. Uh, just, they will not be in any of our big buildings here. We will be building a brand new center on higher lands, which should, in theory, be ready for next summer. Hopefully, hopefully we did start breaking ground on it this, this summer. Just, we, other things got in the way and we couldn't finish it. And it's a, it's a big complex. And uh, so... We went to uh, the backup plan, which was picking four different places and going into them and having all of our announcements there. So, if everything goes well, this will be the very last time Anyone, anyone ever sees this world, as it will get pr probably pretty, pretty much uh, get sent into the back 
back rooms of <laughs> of uh, of everything, and uh, it will probably never really get seen again. It was it's ha we've had a lot of memories here. It was our world. It was our home for so many years, and uh, I I still don't regret making the decision. It was still one of the hardest decisions I've ever made to shut this down and bring and wipe it clean and but uh it was f the right decision it turned out in the long run to be the right decision and i'm excited to see what we do with Higherlands going forward and uh high worlds is already proving to be a pretty big success for me and uh, my entire team and it just it, it is going to be hard not seeing this world any a lot anymore and uh, especially especially with how many hours we've put into it and uh, yeah so with that what we are going to do to end this is just show some of our just have a bit of a big flyover of the entirety of this world just to say one last goodbye. So with that, guys, thank you for tuning in to Year End 24. If you tuned into all four days, thank you. It's going to be probably about a week until the next video's release, uh, at least here, um, as, uh, well, we need to get other things sorted out before we start. Uh, High World Season number two. So, uh, yeah. Later.